<laughs> what is a champion? A miserable pile of pixels. Hi there summoners and welcome to the top 10 my favorite champions video. Instead of talking about the best champions for the current month, I rather wanted to talk about this time about my favorite champions that I think are the coolest overall. My name is Apodix and hope you enjoy. Fiddlesticks is a champion that I don't end up playing that much nowadays, but he's one of the picks that I've liked over the course of time. That Scarecrow presence is just funny and most of the skins represent Fiddle in different ways, but very successfully like the surprise party skin is just wicked. But swag aside, I also think Fiddlesticks has one of the best abilities combined, with good crowd control and damage and my favorite crowd storm is always exciting to use when you hope that you'll end up timing and using it successfully. Katarina is known to be a quite an assassin and works out under certain circumstances quite well. As she doesn't provide any CC whatsoever, her abilities still are pretty addictive with its fast-paced gameplay when combining the passive to the mix. That small adrenaline rush that comes when you get to match the cooldowns properly makes Katarina quite awesome to play and still to this day I really enjoy her and pick up those easy multi-kills now and then. Lee Sin is the blind monk that many players worldwide enjoys to play and I ain't being an exception when it comes to Lee. I just really like how he works out in the game because it's all about chaining the abilities together for maximum fun and there are just so many ways you can execute things instead of the same combo over and over. Like with any skill shot champions, aiming and timing are the keys for success and once you get the full grip with Lee Sin, the fun never stops upon you. Kha'Zix is also one nasty assassin to go with and the way he's executed is just fun experience overall. He is able to dish out squishes very fast with his abilities as the leap provides excellent escape tool and ultimate void assault backs up the rest of the kit perfectly. I also like how Kha'Zix is able to evolve one of his abilities upon leveling 6, 11 and 16 as the evolved leap is absolutely my favorite as it lets you jump insane distances and resets upon assists and kills. Kha'Zix's voice is also something that puts you in the mood, which all combines makes up one badass Void Reaver. Fear the Void. Corky is one of my all-time favorite champions with his quirky appearance and style overall. It all refers to nostalgia as I used to play Corky a lot in the past, but unfortunately nowadays it doesn't feel the same as Phosphorus Bomb has that delay upon hitting the ground, and the ultimate missile barrage has a bit too long cooldown for my taste. With those changes I still like Corky a lot as his skins especially Ice Tobukan are great and that voice acting suits very well for the character itself. I got a bogey on my tail! Lima Oscar Lima! Blitzcrank is the support I've always liked the most from the moment I found myself playing the great Steam Golem. While I think his abilities are pretty supreme altogether, the highlight definitely goes for the Rocket Crab as you can always get that small excitement when grabbing others next to you. It's just something unique that other champions do not offer. Well, Thresh's death sentence is pretty close but it's not as entertaining as the original crab. Blitzcrank is quite funky experience overall, but very dependent on hitting the rocket crab and also the voice acting is okay, robot style voice, but nothing super uber though. Ha, 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 ha. Nar is the only more recently released champion in this list, as from the day release I've had a blast with this one. I first had these weird impressions going on like, who's this little girl boomeranding and hopping the house? But once I saw Megaform and learned how to balance between the two forms, it turned out actually pretty fun. As for the strategy goes, you want to keep your range with Mininar when poking out with the boomerang throw and auto attacks to get some extra damage from Hyper and with Megaform just mash in and let the stun flow. 
So Nari's mostly fun experience as I think the Dino skin is very adorable, but sometimes he can be a little frustrating when those not wanted mega forms will pop out when you would absolutely want or need it for later. Nargada! Ezreal is without a doubt another awesome champion and offers many cool skins like TPA and Pulsefire Ezreal. His voice acting is also very suitable, but the most important thing is his playstyle, as I like how all of his 4 abilities are skillshot oriented, which makes him quite challenging in some circumstances around. Also, whether it's that attack damage or ability power Ezreal we're talking, they're just both great paths, but all abilities discluding Mystic Shot has ability power ratio, which raises the question why AD is more popular. Any regardless, within learning the skill shot basis, Ezreal is without a doubt one of my funniest experiences altogether. Who needs a map? Kragas is the barrel master and without a doubt one of my all-time favorite champions. He's just so funny, throwing his barrels away and roaming around with his fat belly, plus there are endless amount of good skins for him, including Fnatic and Superfan Gragas. I also like how Gragas works in lane, as barrel roll requires timing and accuracy for maximum effort, Drunken Rage keeps Gragas drunk and smooth for boosted attack, Body Slam lets you travel through some walls and does pretty sweet damage, and Explosive Cast is amazing knockback CC spell that works extremely well with other abilities combined, not forgetting the passive that heals you every now and then. And did I almost forget to mention about the voice acting? It's truly one of the best. Just listen. Happy hour incoming! Have a drink! I'll drink you under the table, scrub! <laughs> Vigar is the champion that I first started to play properly in the past, as I found the playstyle a very unique and rewarding experience and therefore it became my all-time favorite champion. Mostly played in the middle lane, Vigar has cool gadgets to offer, as you can farm endless amounts of ability power with Baleful Strike, and that combines with Dark Matter and Primordial Burst, resulting in one of the best damage sources in the game. I also like how Event Horizon is designed when the enemy will get stunned if they cross the perimeter, which will leave the player open up with tactical ways to use it. Vigar's voice acting is also very fitting for this tiny master of evil, and there are plenty of skins to choose from as my absolutely favorite is the final boss Vagar. Well, you don't say, I have it on my current LOL intro and outro. With this information given, Vigar's addictive farm power playstyle and wicked design makes him my favorite champion in League of Legends. But before I end up things here, I wanted to tell you guys about a way to get some quick cash for some RP cards or for your holiday shopping. Did you know companies are willing to pay you for sharing your opinions on things like TV, movies, video games and more? See the link in the description box to sign up for Opinion Outpost. It's free to join, and once you sign up, you may have to check the promotions tab if you use Gmail to see the emails from them. Okay, so that summarizes my top 10 favorite champions for League of Legends. Hope you enjoy. Please rate and let me know what are your favorite champions in the comments below. And don't forget to check out the opinion outpost, the links are in the video description below. That's it for this time, my name is Podix and have a nice day.